Owens then transferred back to Luke Air Force Base near Phoenix, Arizona, March 1953. And because of their involvement with organizing, first came out in 1938, built by North American Aviation before. The Army Air Corps called that the T-6 Texan. It is an advanced trainer. The Navy called that same airplane the F and J. S meaning Navy, N, the F meant training, the S meant Navy. The contractor that built the airplane because the forerunner to North American aviation was the Erlinger Joyce Company. Or two, you may hear that this was the second most produced American aircraft in the world. Well, that's the and in the first 1,500 of these were built in America. Most advanced training that a pilot would get in his first, we got into a little more complex airplane.
Here's the military piper come low and slow. A devastating uh, weapon. That but handled correctly. Either as a sighting device you're gonna or take, as uh, you're gonna an airport go to the north and hold, bazooka a attack aircraft. Yes, they were. Okay. You you want to keep them. your house or your okay. farm. Okay. And you had a Thank son you. in the military. The news was not good. <laughs> this is an actual If further details or other information are okay, received, you will be promptly Z6 is coming behind us now over Arrow Shell Square in their green formation. All right, and the PC3, C47 behind us again over uh, theaters of woods. You can turn around and imagine the sky is filled with hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of those. I also want to read you an actual letter that was sent by a prisoner of war. Uh, look after things, as I'm sure you will, and the rest for me will say good crowd. I'm sure now of coming home someday. So let's hope this message over to them. You can write, but not too often. More later, from the same guy, Bill. Thank you. 